welcome to Howard Cuisine today I'm making a cheque today I'm gonna show you guys how to make a cheque so that's a cheque but the cheque they always come like this like a big ball like this like very solid so what you're supposed to do you're gonna break all the cheque like in small pieces just like this you see how solid they come they come like this that's a cheque they come just like this so you're gonna break it down like in small pieces like this you see like this it look like a like a couscous a little bit but it's not couscous this is made of um, cassava so it's not couscous it's cassava made of cassava they call it a cheque so you see what I did I break it like a little pieces and I add some water I add some water and I put it in the microwave for six seconds if you put it in the microwave for six seconds, if it, six seconds is over, you're gonna try it. Like you see how soft it looks right now, it's very soft because it's well done. You see? Nice and soft. So after it's cooked already, because they come cooked already, they was frozen. So what are you supposed to do? Just warm it up a little bit. That's all you're gonna do. So that's the cheque. The cheque is um, ready. So what I'm doing now, I'm gonna show you guys how to make the sauce for that chicken so this is cucumber so what I did I peeled the cucumber cucumber and uh, cut in a little pieces and this is tomato so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna add the tomato like this so I just add the tomato I supposed to cut some onions but what happened I just find I don't have no onions and it's too late now it's nine o'clock already so I can not able to go to the supermarket to go buy um, some onions right now. So you can add some onions and some bell pepper, like a green pepper. A lot of time that's how I do. So what I do, I add some vinegar. This is one big spoon of vinegar. Like this kind of like a tablespoon. This kind of big size of, um, that's like a big size of spoon. What I do, I'm going to measure it like that. So I just ready measure already. So you're gonna add the vinegar. So when you add the vinegar, and I'm gonna add my Maggi too. My Maggi season. Yeah, I know my favorite Maggi season. This season is very good, and I love it. Like any kind of Maggi you have home, you can add that too. So you're gonna add the seasoning, and you're gonna add some cooking oil too. So I got some cooking oil after the one I, I used to fry my chicken yesterday. So this is uh, my less on uh, my leftover fried chicken uh, oil. So that got a lot of seasoning already. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add some of those oil too. So I'm gonna mix them together. Okay, this is the sauce. So I already add some oil, cooking oil. What I did, I put five spoon of uh, this cooking oil. So I measured a uh, five spoon of cooking oil. When I add the Maggi, like the way I show you guys before, so this is the Maggi. Any Maggi you have home, you can add that. So I mix them together, and I taste it. And it tastes very nice, like the way I want it. And I did some barbecue too today. My husband did this barbecue for me today. So I got some. Um, this is uh, meat. That's uh, and some chicken. So I got chicken and beef. So I already rolled my chicken and the meat already. The, everything is nice and done already. And this is the sauce. And this is the chicken. And I already yesterday I made some more hot pepper. I got some hot pepper in the fridge, well made. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make a plate and show you guys how to do it, okay? Okay, I'm making my husband plate already. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take some I check it and put it in the plate just like that. I already washed my hand. My hand is nice and clean. So I'm gonna add that check it just like this in the plate. Because the check is plain don't have no seasoning. What are you gonna do? You're gonna put some seasoning on that check too. Just see what I'm doing right now. You see the seasoning? You're gonna add some seasoning on that check and mix it very well with your hand or spoon, whatever you got. I like to mix it with my hand because I'm making it for my husband, so he don't mind, for sure. So I'm going to mix it with my hand just like this. 
and you're gonna try and make sure that check it guys some season on it because don't put too much season on it because you know the sauce got season already you don't want to over salt it and that's very good I like the way it is right now it's nice so that's the sauce already the one I just made so I'm gonna add some sauce on that check it You're gonna add some oil too because such a case is very dry. You need to add some oil. And I'm gonna add some meat. And some chicken. So that's my husband plate I just made for him. So that's the achake I just made. And you're going to put the hot pepper next to the uh, chicken. So that's it. And that's all. That's how you make achake. And now uh, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Thank you for watching my video. And I really appreciate it every day. I really appreciate it. So please go and subscribe. If you subscribe. So that's the reason why I will be able to make more video because I know y'all want to watch my video. But if you guys don't subscribe, that means like y'all really don't want to watch the video. So I'm going to stop. So thank you for watching. Bye y'all.